I realised I need to burn up my ego because that ego is my biggest hurdle. It had made me blind, disrespectful and so selfish that I could not see my own flaws. I hurt your self-esteem and all the good you did to me. I not only trusted, ignored it, but I picked up the statement you made when you had enough of my immature and childish behaviour. The time you tried to tell me what's better for me, I took it as an insult and took it very personally. I didn't want it to be the wrong person, ever. But all my mistakes dawned upon me when I suffered during the long separation. I realised that if only I didn't have such you solon up ego, I would have seen your love as love your advice as a pulse of wisdom that I could use. I was always a smarter with love but never taught to be grateful for all the things other people had been doing for me throughout my life. So when you came along doing all the loving things for me I didn't see it too. I was an independent, I could not make a single decision on my own. Rather, I always expected other people to take care of me. My tantrums and lack of apology had risen to a new heights, but all the disrespect and all the ungratefulness I had expressed towards you, it all came back to haunt me and eventually teach me the most important lessons of love. I learned that love is not just for fun and entertainment. Love is not about just good times, but it's about responsibility. Love makes you to take care of people. People who matter to you, it's about being a giver and not always a taker. I do feel a lot of guilt for the things I didn't do for you. All the good things I didn't do for you, it hurts me. Because back in those days when I had all the time and opportunity, I took your presence for granted in my life. But now I feel immense love for you without getting angry on myself. Your love is the most precious and priceless thing you have given to me, the experiences I had, the situation I faced, everything was teaching me to come close to you, to understand the unconditional love you had for me. I realized with time that unconditional love is different from the type of love I was taught about, and the encounter I had with you had led to this discovery, and I wish nothing but all the happiness for you.